right now I got uh, I've got Chris with uh, Sky Ventures with me, and we're going to talk a little bit about uh, uh, terminal velocity, yep. aerodynamics. Yep. What's what's the science behind that stuff, Chris? Well, um, your body position has everything to do with the way you fly. Um, if you see here, the folks that are flying right now are flying on their bellies. The ideal body position for belly flying is just what you see. It's a nice full body arch. The whole point being when the wind hits the body, spills off cleanly and it doesn't get caught up anywhere and it makes you nice and aerodynamic. Just like a ball falls straight down through the sky and a sheet of paper will rock all the way down. If you're trying to be more like the ball than the sheet of paper that bunches up everywhere. A little science behind that. You know how to make the paper and the uh, ball hit at the same time? Walk the paper up into a ball and it'll hit the paper. Yeah, there you go. Everything, Aerodynamic. Everything falls at the same rate. What changes your terminal velocity here, terminal velocity terminal being... Terminal velocity. That, you don't say that around old people. It's the very fastest that a human body, or anybody for that matter, is going to fall. You can control that, though, by your body position. Just like anything else, like a, an airplane or a missile or a rocket. Really? You make yourself more aerodynamic. The rocket. You're going to have less drag. You know, it's full circle. And you're going to fall faster. So let's say what he's doing right now. If he were to arch his hips another five inches, his whole body's going to fold up. And he's going to cut right through the air and drop down. Uh, just the opposite. If he's going to flatten his body out, his whole body's going to catch a little bit more air and it's going to lift him up. In the sky, it's going to translate to a change in your fall rate. You're going to fall faster and you're going to fall slower. You never go up in the sky, unlike here. Fly anyway. So, how fast can, can a human body fall? When you What's fall on your belly, yeah. terminal velocity for the average human being on their belly is about 120 miles an hour. Um, but, like I said, you can change that. That's on in a relaxed, comfortable belly position. Let's say you fly vertically, upside down on your head, or in a sit fly, standing up. Um, you've dramatically reduced your drag, you've dramatically increased your speed. Um, flying upside down in my head, I go about 200 miles an hour in the 200 sky. 200 miles per so hour? So very easily without even trying. If I were to streamline that, uh, the world speed record 343. 343. All right, Chris, how fast do you think a guy like me yeah, like you, I'm gonna could say go? About 120 Turn or so. Turn well, can, can go and will go are two different things. Can go, you could do 250. I want to go about 15 probably. miles an hour. <laughs> so we can get that too. We can get that too. You fly on your belly, you're going to go a lot slower than that. You got one of those. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Chris. Yeah, no problem. My pleasure. Right. Good All job. Right.